I'm running a little later than I thought. The second phone call of the night. I, I had to talk to some lady's cat. In some ways, it was pivotal. Yeah. Yeah, I miss you too. Unfortunately, privacy was at a minimum. Yeah. Yeah. Winnie, I, I can't say it right now. What the hell? I love you too. Very funny. And with those words of encouragement, I was back on the road, ready for anything. Find out what it means to me. Of course, the role of a delivery boy wasn't exactly for the faint of heart. Fact is, sometimes you had to be a little pushy to get the job done. You had to be ready to deal with strange characters. Very strange characters. Mr. Kramer? You're looking for Mr. Kramer? Uh... Yeah, he ordered some food from Chong's Chinese. I very much doubt it. No, I have the slip right here. Look, will you just let me talk to the guy? My boss will get mad if I don't deliver this food. As you wish. <laughs> like I said, sometimes you just had to get tough, not take no for an answer. Here we are. Mr. Kramer? It was a delivery boy's worst nightmare. The ultimate practical joke. I don't think he'll be needing a fortune cookie. And there you had it. Delivering Chinese food wasn't just a job. It wasn't just an occupation. Hey, you got any egg rolls? In its own way, it was war. <laughs> <laughs> 